Frankie is considered to be the founder of house music. He would never credit himself with that sort of thing. To him, he was just making music and doing what he was passionate about, which was playing records. The things that he was doing with sound, it was remarkable and unique. It was raw, it was powerful. And through a big booming system, it moved your heart, it moved your soul. The Frankie Knuckles Foundation was founded after Frankie made his transition in 2014 with the thought that the foundation would keep his legacy intact and educate the world and advocate some of the causes that he was passionate about. AIDS awareness and prevention, LGBTQ youth homelessness, music in schools, and diabetes research. There are people who are witness to or transformed by this music. I really want to make sure that not only is there a great home for the objects, but really that this home would then allow for some of these conversations to grow. The Arts Bank made absolutely the best fit because of the care that we knew Theaster would give. Also that Theaster appreciated the art. This isn't a simple collection of just vinyl. This is his own personal record collection. His hands were on these records. His sweat, probably a few spilled drinks. So there's a real genuine quality of like an artifact. The collection is meant to be felt. The expert for helping people feel the collection is actually the DJ. And so our hope is to try to attract world-class DJs and local DJs who are the scholars of house and invite them to pump the music as hard as they can, to kind of be in the spirit of Frankie Knuckles, and then share that with this neighborhood, our city, and the world. This was his calling, you know, was to not entertain, but to bring people together and have it sometimes even transform your feelings about music and feelings about being with other people. He really gave a lot to the music community globally as well as the community here in Chicago.